That's a gorgeous car. A Porsche uh, Fiat 126. When Tom Hanks survived the crash in this car, apparently in Fiat 126P, the crush zone ends at the engine. Unfortunately, the engine in this car is located at the rear of the car. Therefore, crash tests were carried out at a speed of only 40 kilometers per hour. Relax, Tom. Science will save you. In the 1990s, an energy absorber was developed. Surprisingly, the car remains intact when it collides with the EPAR barrier at the same speed. However, in crash tests, it is only suitable for scrap. Moreover, the barrier also remains intact, which may be counterintuitive. In addition, the displacement of the movable element of the absorber is small. The principle of operation is simple. Kinetic energy is transferred through a bumper with a pusher to the mass wheel. The linear motion of the car is converted into rotation of the mass wheel. The description of the physics of this mechanism is a bit more complicated. It is a topic for a separate longer video. Question. Derek, would you accept the challenge?